Sierra Nevada. It's a, it's a good brand. It looks Christmassy. It smells very happy. It smells like beer. Mm. This tastes the most like a normal beer that you can yeah. just get any time of the year. A little too bitter for Christmas, in my opinion. Yeah, it does not. It doesn't put me in that holiday spirit. You're not singing Big Crosby. No, I'm not. <laughs> nor am I singing Three. <laughs> This is the Mad Elf Ale. Covered with honey and cherries. Appalling graphic design, but that's fine. It's got an appalling smell too, frankly. Yeah. It tastes like fruitcake to me. Ooh, too sweet for me. Yeah, it's not good. That really does taste like drinking liquor. I mean, yeah. <laughs> yeah I would not pay $20 for that. I have my standards. Yeah. Thirsty dog. Mm. All time. Ale brewed with honey and spices. Uh oh. Yeah. Yeah, honey's back. You know, dogs were harmed in the making of this beer. It smells a little bit like a Christmas candle. There's a lot of nutmeg in there. Mm. <laughs> it kind of tastes like if you licked off the top layer of eggnog. <laughs> it doesn't really remind me of Christmas. No, it's just like a lot of flavors that I still want in beer. This one. This is Frosted Frog Christmas Ale. Do frog to drink beer? It smells like cookies. Aww. Gingerbread cookies. Um, it does not taste like beer. Now this one tastes bad, but I don't know if that's just because it's from Ohio. It kind of tastes like a gingerbread cookie. It's too sweet. Okay, I gotta, I can't, I can't finish that. Delirium Noel from Belgium. This one features an elephant. Yeah, I think I like that one better than most of the other ones. It smells like beer. It smells like beer. This is easily the most carbonated yeah. of all five beers. It's sort of boring. Like, this is the best of them. Good. It's good.